What is up, YouTube? Favros here with a quick vlog. <laughs> Yo, it's been a minute since we said that, huh? Yo, we need some music. All right, there we go. Music engaged. Credits will be in the description below. Anywho, it's been a minute, YouTube. How have y'all been? Let me know in the comments below. Um, we have a lot to talk about. We have a lot to talk about today, YouTube. So get comfortable. Grab yourself a snack. Grab yourself a drink. Um, and let's get to it. So, I've been pretty inactive on the tubes lately. Here's why. Hopefully y'all understand. I feel like we all got together. Uh, me, the viewers, everyone in the hood was in high school, man. We were playing the Soul Calibers. We were going ham into Soul Calibur. We got out of high school. We went into college. We started doing work in the colleges. Actually, I was probably in college the whole time I was playing Soul Calibur. But anyway, we finished up college, and you guys know what happened. Your boy got hit by student teaching. We got hit with all the real-life responsibilities. Um, we graduated with our bachelors, didn't have a job, was struggling to find a job started substitute teaching. I was going in the school districts. I was teaching the youth how to do work, homies. I was teaching them and I was making a little bit of money. I was making a little bit of side money. Don't get me wrong, but substitute teaching was very inconsistent for me. Um, some days I got four days of work a week or some weeks and some weeks I got one or two days of work a week. And I had met Courtney right around those times. Courtney's actually sitting right over there. You guys can probably hear. Um, and I was looking for a way to provide for me and her. So, what happened? I think most of you knows this by now, but maybe not, so I'll be quick. Uh, what happened was, at the beginning of last year, okay, 2014, February 2014, my father, who owns his own electrical company and has for 20-something years, um, got an, an offer for a giant contract to, to do maintenance on 130 locations up in Chicago. We used to live in St. Louis, uh, Missouri, about 350 miles south from here. Well, he got an offer to do maintenance, routine, monthly, regular maintenance for a couple years uh, minimum, a couple years minimum for 130 locations. And he was like, yo, this is a big contract. This is a lot of money, but I don't have anyone to manage it. I don't have anyone I trust. And he looks at me and goes, Dave, would you like to do it? And I was struggling for work for the time, uh, like I said, and I was struggling to provide for me and Courtney. So, of course, your boy said, hell yeah, let's do it. And just like that, I moved up to Chicago in a weekend and I've been working with this business, pretty much running my own business, which is an extension of his business, ever since. So we've been swamped. We've been swamped, which leads me, I'm not just having story time here. I got some, I got good news for you guys though. That was all the bad news, now comes the good news, okay? Well, we're getting there anyway. So we've been swamped. We've been down on our luck. We haven't had a lot of time. Work has been stressing us out. It's been burning us out. It's been taking our energy. It's been taking all our time. It's been rough, Twitch. Um, me and Courtney are engaged. We're getting, or I just called you guys Twitch. Oh my God. I'm getting to that. It's been rough YouTube anyway. So, um, and there's a lot of things I have to say for, and a lot of things I have to do. Me and Courtney are looking to buy our own house right now. We're renting a house and any of you who have bought your own house before know that there's a ton that goes into it. It's a ton of time. It's a ton of effort. Uh, we're looking to plan our wedding. All this shit's happening this year. So still, even now, I'm swamped for time. But, like I said, there's good news in this video. So you've been watching for three and a half minutes and you're about to be rewarded for it. The reason I'm making this vlog is to let you guys know that I am not dead. I am still in it. I am still making content on the internet. I'm still doing work, homies. Just not really in Soul Calibur anymore. Um, the ma I'm more of an MMO gamer now. I still love my fighting games. I'm still looking for a good fighting game I can play on PC. The thing is, I used to have an Xbox. I used to have Xbox Live. I don't anymore. Right now, I'm just a PC gamer. So I'm looking for a fighting game that I can play on PC. Some people have suggested Mortal Kombat 10. Uh, post in the comments below if you have Mortal Kombat 10 for PC. Originally, I heard the online was so ass, it's not even worth buying if you're going to try to play it online. Uh, seriously. So I haven't bought that yet. But I, I've also heard that the online has been patched and it's functional now. Which, it, if it is, I'm going to start making content on it. Let me know in the comments if you know any better than me. Um, but, okay, so here's how it is. So, I work five days a week. I get off work around four or five o'clock every day. Uh, actually, not every day. Most days I get off around that time. And 
I'm free, but I'm burnt out, and I don't have a lot of energy or time to read or edit and render videos like I used to. So what have I been doing? I still had that itch. I still had that itch to put out content. I still had that itch to do work and talk with all my homies and share my excitement and passion for gaming. So what did I start doing? I started live streaming, and I started live streaming Final Fantasy XIV. I said I was a bit of an MMO gamer now, and Final Fantasy XIV is what I'm playing. I play every single day. I have a progression rating team. We are on the last boss in the game, homies. Bahamut Prime, all right? The biggest, most badass dragon of them all. We're fighting them. Your boy Faros is fighting them. I'm healing. I'm a white mage healer, so I'm healing them life bars. Just arm wrestling them back to full when they get damaged. Um, it's, it's been pretty hype. Uh, Twitch, uh, I, I live stream on Twitch now. I do three times a week. I live stream every Saturday, every Sunday, and every Wednesday as of right now, and I'm trying to live stream more. And here's why live stream uh, works for me without taking too much more of your guys' time. Uh, you know, I can wrap up work for the day. I wrap up work, boom. I hit broadcast, done. We're live, and we're having fun, and we're putting out content for the homies. Uh, and it's that easy. I don't have to render. I don't have to edit. I don't have to spend all this time uploading. I don't have to do nothing besides hit that broadcast button. And that's why it's worked so well for me, helping me get back into the entertainment side of things. It's worked so well because it's been easy for me. And you guys know with doing work anyway with the Soul Calibur videos, I always commentated live. I pretty much, it was pretty much a recording of a live stream that I edited a tiny bit and put on YouTube. So I was pretty much just streaming for YouTube. You know, it's kind of weird to think of it that way. But I was like already doing... What I'm trying to say is what I do on live stream now is exactly what I was doing for doing work. So it, like it's a perfect fit for me. Live stream has became live streaming on Twitch has became the perfect fit for me. But I feel like all you guys don't know about it yet. So I wanted to make a video letting you know that I'm streaming a lot on Twitch. Um, link will be link to my uh, Twitch channel will be on the description below. Check for go to that channel, follow me up, check for me on Saturdays, Sundays, and Wednesdays for sure. Courtney actually streams on Thursdays, and I'm looking to even stream more, maybe on Tuesdays or Fridays. I'm looking to get more into it, so you guys can check for me then as well. Uh, but just follow me up; you're gonna get notified on uh, your email associated with your Twitch account whenever I go live. Also, I would follow me up on Twitter or my Facebook. Links to them will also be in the description below uh, because sometimes Twitch doesn't send out the email. It's actually been super buggy as of lately. Now, if you're following me, you'll see me on your followed streams whenever you go on Twitch to look for live streams. You'll see me, um, but I post almost every single stream on Twitter and Facebook, so you guys will definitely see me if you're following me on those platforms. But the Twitch has been picking up, homies, and I'm going to try to make this vlog not much longer than it already is, but I want to let you know that we started streaming. We've been making big strides in the Final Fantasy XIV community. People starting to recognize us. People starting to get hype about the Faro stream. Uh, there's actually a network of Final Fantasy XIV streamers. They have their own team. They have their own live streaming team. It's called the Dream Network. And these people have been around a while. But they saw us and was like, Yo, Faros, join the join the Dream Network, dude. You gotta get in on this. Get in on the Dream Network, man. They invited us after like a month or two of streaming. I've been at it now. Uh, they said, yo, get in here. Get, get in here. We want you on the team. So I joined the Dream Network. Link to their website will also be linked in the description below. And they have a cool little uh, widget at the top right of their website. It shows which Dream Network members are live. So when I'm live, I'll be up on their website. I have my own page there with my description. I have my own for there's there's forums on the Dream Network website. There's sub forums. There's their own Faros forums. So I'm just pimping out Dream Network a little bit. I wanted to let you guys know about that so you know another way you can get a hold of me, chat with me, uh, and and make sure you're notified about the streams. So recap, your boy's still super busy. I'm gonna stay super busy for a little bit longer. Um, I got the house to plan for, and I got the wedding and the honeymoon to plan for, and then after that, I'm pretty much home free, okay? So we got a little bit longer. We're going to, by the end of this year, we're going to be back to ourselves, all right? We're going to have all the time in the world. I'm going to be settled into a house. Wedding will be, uh, we'll, I'll be back from that and the honeymoon and everything, and I'll just be able to focus on doing what I love, playing games, and bringing that to you guys. In the meantime, we're going to be live streaming because it's easier and it's more time efficient for me than YouTube. So you can catch me on twitch.tv slash Faros for those awesome streams. It's mostly MMOs right now, but I will maybe 
pick up fighting games here soon if, if I can get into Mortal Kombat X or another one that I can play online. I'm also thinking about playing off games like Path of Exile with some of the Dream Network guys, so there's that. Uh, what else was I going to say, homies? Oh, shit, we're, we're coming up on that 10-minute mark. I'm starting to panic. Anyway, that's what I really wanted to tell you guys. Oh, YouTube, though, I might start putting my Twitch highlights up on YouTube. If you guys would like that, let me know in the comments below if you would like to see the Twitch highlights on YouTube because that's something I could easily upload to YouTube. It's not going to take a lot of editing either. Give you guys sort of highlights from the stream, exciting points, funny points, things like that. All right, that's all I wanted to say, man. Yo, shout-outs to all you homies at home that are still checking out the Faro's videos. It's been such a pleasure making content for you guys. You guys are my friends, man. Love you guys, and I'm sorry I haven't been that active lately. Uh, here on the YouTubes and guys I really hope you believe me when I say I feel bad about that um, It's something I built up for years and years man. It's always been a dream and a passion of mine But I'm gonna get it back and I've been trying to get back into it through twitch twitch has been my gateway drug back to the YouTubes Okay, we're gonna get back. It's just gonna take a little bit longer And it's gonna take something that I can get super passionate about again like I was with Soul Calibur Maybe if they put samurai into Final Fantasy 14, maybe that's gonna be it, you know Maybe if they, if I get a fighting game on PC that I can really get into, maybe that's going to be it. Maybe it's the Dream Network, and I, and you know, I already love them, but maybe we're just going to find something to where I can just, boom, it all clicks, and I'm, I'm cool making videos on it. You know, I just, the wheels are turning, we're getting back into it. I wanted to make this video saying thank you to everyone who's still tuned in, thank you to everyone who's still watching, and I wanted to prep you guys for maybe the Twitch highlights that are going to be showing up on the YouTube channel, and let you know about the Twitch channel in case you didn't know about it already. All right, homies. I'm out. It's been so real. Let me know how you're doing in the comments below. I really want to talk to you guys. I'll be looking forward to it. Follow me on all the links below. You guys will be able to talk at me there. Until next time, as always, you all take care. This has been Faros with YouTube.com slash Faros TTTT. Peace out.